in olden days when there were no cure for bacterial diseases then there was widespread death among people now the various bacterial diseases that affected men at different points and in different places were mycobacterium tuberculosis which caused a respiratory disease known as tuberculosis now this bacteria is rod shaped just like your favorite chips so these rod shaped bacteria are known as bacillus another disease was predominant in uh, a lot of parts of the world and that was cholera the main symptoms of cholera was a lot of vomiting and watery stools cholera was caused by this comma shaped bacteria known as vibrio cholerae a sexually transmitted disease known as syphilis had caused widespread death in europe now this syphilis was caused by a spiral shaped bacteria known as treponema pallidum where trepo means turn and nema means a chain so till now we have discussed about three diseases caused by bacteria of three different shapes now look at this bacteria it has a ball like shape and it forms a chain like structure now these type of bacteria that are spherical shaped and forms a chain like structure are known as streptococcus where strepto means chain and coccus means a ball and one kind of such streptococcus bacteria is known as streptococcus pneumoniae which causes pneumonia in a man now these ball like bacteria when they form an aggregate and looks like a bunch of grapes it is known as staphylococcus where staphylo means a bunch of grapes and coccus means spherical or ball shaped one such bacteria is known as staphylococcus aureus that looks like this and causes a disease in man known as fu furuncle so still now we've discussed about spherical shaped bacteria that contains many units and forms a chain like structure like in case of streptococcus and forms a uh, appearance of a bunch of grapes as in the case of staphylococcus now these coccus shaped or spherical shaped bacteria can also be present in few units such as in uh, it can be present as one unit known as monococcus where mono means single or one or it can be a uh, diplococcus where there are two spherical structures or two spherical shaped bacteria so bacteria can have different shapes such as bacillus that is rod shaped bacteria that causes tuberculosis coccus bacteria or spherical shaped bacteria vibrio or comma shaped bacteria that causes cholera and finally spirulum bacteria that looks like a spiral and causes the sexually transmitted disease syphilis now uh, in the world there was an outbreak of different bacterial diseases at different points of time now when a disease evolved it evolved in one small place and then it spread to a bigger area or a vast area so according to the spread of the disease disease can be categorized as sporadic when only scattered individual cases of a disease has been reported such as cholera and malaria in india and if a disease is found in a certain area only affecting a few people in the population it is known as an endemic disease such as goiter in the sub himalayan range of india disease that spreads from one place to 
to another affecting a large number of people at the same time is known as an epidemic disease, such as plague in 1994 in India. And finally, a disease that has widely distributed worldwide is known as a pandemic disease like AIDS that has engulfed almost the entire of the world.